What's good, CBT fam? Before y'all get into the video, make sure y'all hit that subscribe button and that post notification bell to get notified every time I upload content. Peace. What's good, YouTube? It is your boy, Big Cool, coming to you from Colossal Box and Talk. Colossal Box and Talk is associated with Three Kings Box and Under the Movement Umbrella, and I am back with another video. Joe Joyce, heavyweight prospect, 2016 silver medalist, um, has called out Jarrell Big Baby Miller. As you all know, Joyce is 4-0. I did a spotlight video on him, highlighting some of the pros and cons about um, him. But at 4-0, he's ready to uh, step up. He's 32 years old, so that he's on the fast track. He's promoted by David Hay at Haymaker Promotions, and he feels he's been avoided. He wanted to fight Derek Jazor in his second or third fight. Jazor uh, declined, um, although Jazor is still a potential opponent as well as the winner of Sexton, Sam Sexton versus Huey Fury. He wants to face Jarrell Big Baby Miller. He even said that he'd go over to you know Miller's backyard and, and fight him. He called himself the Big Novice versus Big Baby. Um, of course, Big Baby Miller didn't want anything to do with it, not because he's ducking, but because he has bigger fish to fry. He's coming off of a um, unanimous decision um, victory over Johan Duhafis, where, he, you know, he looked okay. He's also in the mix. He's in the running. As a potential opponent to face WBA, IBF, IBO, and WBO heavyweight unified champion Anthony Joshua um, this year. And why would he risk, you know, his standing, his position in the WBA to take a fight with a guy who hasn't proven himself as a professional? Um, of course, Miller being the guy that he is, he responded saying he looked like a light, light skin, light brown Birch from the Adams family. He told him he not know Vasil Lomachenko, another English muffin, um, who should be calling out people. He told him to get ten more um, professionals, you know, get ten professional fights under your belt. Then come holler at him. I'll link the um, I'll post the link in the description below so you all can check it out. But I mean, I I like this from Joyce, who isn't trying to waste time. He's thirty two years old. Um. He's a solid fighter. I mean, I don't think he's going to be anything special. I think they need to slow him down a little bit because he still does a lot of shit that's going to get him knocked the fuck out. He squares himself up. He's a bit robotic. He doesn't use his jab enough. He's very powerful. Um, he's a good potty puncher. Has a very good left hook. But, you know, he's he's raw as a, um, as a professional. And that amateur shit is not going to work in the program. So, he needs to continue to uh, get more um, experience under his belt, you know, slowly step up his competition. And then once he's ready for a Big Baby Miller, a Dillian White, a Huey Fury, um, he'll really be ready. He won't just be trying to talk himself in his, into fights that he hasn't earned yet. But, I mean, this is a an intriguing fight. Um, if Jarrell Miller was to decide to go down that right route. But we're not. I'm with Jarrell Miller on this. Why do something so stupid like that when you're this close to a title shot? Whether you actually get it against Joshua or not, you could fight Marzik Walk, um, you know, for a, a secondary WBA title, um, and really be in firm position to get a fight with Anthony Joshua some da sometime down the line. So we'll see how um, Joyce continues to progress. We'll see if uh, Miller's gonna get the nod for. A, a, a shot at Joshua, um, but like I said, I respect Joyce for for calling um, Jarrell Big Baby Miller out. Obviously, even though Jarrell Big Baby Miller is a top ten guy, he's looked at by Joyce and a lot of people, myself included, included as more of a uh, pretender than a contender. But you got to put somebody in those top ten spots, so he gets one. But Joyce is, Joyce obviously feels even with only four fights and things he definitely needs to prove on. He could uh, compete with Big Baby Miller, and I agree. He has the amateur pedigree. He has the overall more boxing experience because he had a long amateur um, boxing career. Um, he would be more, you know, refined as a fighter, even though it doesn't look that way uh, when you watch him, than Jarrell Miller, who's a former um, kickboxer. So we'll see, man. 
Um, if you like this video, do what I told you to do in the beginning. Head over to Facebook, find the Colossal Boxing Talk Facebook page, like that page, follow me on Twitter at Colossal CBT. Drop a comment in the comment section below. Shout out to everybody in the movement that's moving with us. Be sure to check out 3kingsboxing.com every day for your latest and greatest unfiltered, unbiased boxing news reported the way it should be. Until next time, I'm out. Peace.